This is Anthony, Hi. by the way, Philippa. How are you? I'm doing well. How are you doing? Doing today? great. So thank you so much. Um, I know you're very busy. I'll try to be as brief as possible. Oh, thank you. Um, I love this cast, and I love seeing diversity and acceptance, and the acceptance of diversity in entertainment. Mm -hmm. um, so thank you so much for your part in Hamilton. Thank you so much oh, for your part you. in this, um, in this feature film debut. Can you talk a little bit about what it means? Uh, to be a part of this cast and having this diversity represented in this film? Uh, it's incredibly um, affirming to be a part of this cast and be in this film, um, to be uh, included in, in noting the diversity of this film. I think it goes without saying that the more diversity we see in the films that we make and the stories that we make, the better. Mm -hmm. um, it's been changing. It's been changing at a slower pace than I'd like to see, but it's it's on its way there. And when we will catch up with that, the more that we keep doing this kind of stuff. Now, I'm curious if you could talk a little bit about Camelot and your upcoming role portraying Guinevere. Yeah. Um, what most excites you about playing that role? I get to work with the best people in the world. I get to say the words of Aaron Sorkin every day. <laughs> which is very exciting. And I have an incredible cast, an incredible ensemble, incredible crew. The design elements, the direction, the words, the music, there's a 30-piece orchestra, it's a 27-person cast. I mean, it is just glorious. And we have built something that I feel very proud of, and I'm excited for people to see. So I have one last question, and then I'll let you go. Um, I'm very much aware that little girls all around the world look up to you. I'm making an effort to ask questions to extreme, extremely accomplished people with children's aspirations in mind. Um, can you talk a little bit about what it would take for someone following in your footsteps to become the next star? Oh my gosh. I think um, the best thing that I can say is if you truly love it, pursue it. And know that it is a long road and failure is a part of an artist's journey. There are ebbs and flows, there are ups and downs. And that's how we learn and grow from those experiences. Thank you so much. Thank you. I, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Nice to meet you guys. Thank you.